I'm Justin. I'm Janier. And this is Childish. And thank you all for joining us this week on Childish. We took a break last week, but we are back and we have a cool new game for folks to play. And Janier, you want to explain what our little friend in the fishbowl is and what game this is? Yes, we are playing Blowfish Blow Up. <laughs> and wait, wait, I like the other name. What's the French? Poison Balloon. Poison Balloon is the French name for it. Poison Balloon. So, yes. So, so it's a kid's game, ages four and up. We got from our friend Octavia, who's made appearances on the show quite a few times. Yeah. And she got us, this is a gift, which I think is a really cool gift. We did get to play it a few times with her. And um, we're gonna play it with you guys now and give a review on it. So as you know, on Childish, we take the kids' games, play them at adult parties, and we turn them into drinking games a lot of the times. So, so um, for this game, it's a beautiful. So we're gonna dig in and it's a whole bunch of different pieces. They have different weights and everything. And then there's a little balance on the bottom. If you hit it too hard, the blowfish will blow up. And whoever and the blowfish it, blows up on? When, when you take out too many and it gets off tilted, it'll blow up. So let's see. And whoever it blows up on loses. Yeah. So, Maybe and it can play. Yep. It's set. I believe so. Yeah, it's set. Okay. Um, <laughs> And it says, how many players can play at a time? It says two or more. And so this is really a game where you can start taking out dinner. You can go first. Um, this is a game where you can pass it around at a party and a bunch of different people can try to get in and get in on the fun. So, and just everyone kind of goes around and grabs what, and you don't need to worry about hitting the blowfish because as Janair said, it's really about knocking it off balance. Um, and when that weight is, Unevenly distributed, distributed. Mm -hmm. Come in the pinky ring. Rinky dink, pinky ring don't even make your pinky blink. Boo. Was that camera? Yeah. Don't be hating on camera. I think I'm hating on camera. You got some coins. You ain't got no coins. I need some diamonds. Diamonds in the back. See, y'all get to hear a little bit of my. Ah! It blew up on Janir! It blew up on Janir! It blew up. Yes, it did. He popped up on you. He popped up on you. Yes, he did. It came out and I saw it hit you. Hit you. I won. I mean, that's kind of. Yes, it was set right. He popped. What you mean, how you lose? He popped up on you. How he pop up on me? Pop off, son. He popped up. What you mean, how he pop up? He See, every I time I pushed it back down, what's that got to do with anything? How you going? Keep going. Sore loser. Sore loser. Fast. You lost. You lost. So let's rate this game now. On a, oh, you know what? Um, while we're rating it, usually the loser has to drink, but um, me and Janair have got a really good wine here. It's Iconis and it's a Cabernet Sauvignon. And there's only a little bit, only a little bit of wine left. So figured this week, the winner gets the drink. Would you like something? No, I wasn't gonna share anyways. I was about to pull it back anyways, y'all know me. But so let's talk about this game. Um, what would you rate it on a scale of one to five on fun? You want to rate it? We can both rate. We can go back and forth. I like this game. It was an give it a four. Okay. And you know, it was okay with me and you playing it, but like we said, we played it with our friend Octavia and it was a lot more fun. I think like the more people that you have involved in this game, mm -hmm. the better it'll be. And especially at a party when people are a little drunk and just walking in and out, boom, it'll, it's a, it'll be a really cool game in that regard. So you gave it a, what? I gave it a four. A four. And uh, next we have um, inclusiveness. inclusiveness. How do you rate on inclusiveness? Inclusiveness, I give this a five because, like I said, it can get a lot of people involved. You guys saw how fast it goes, and it can be something something really um, it just it's, it doesn't take a lot of thought. And that's a lot of things that we look for in these party games is we don't want to have to use our minds too much because people are doing other things and just want to get involved and play. And yes, and intoxicated. <laughs> and uh, so lastly, what was what's our last category? Is fun and ease. Ease, ease. I'd give it a five with ease. Yeah, yeah, definitely a five. It's a, it's a super easy game it's to play. Set up people a little bit with, um, 
confused with the setup, but otherwise it was very easy. Yeah, and so he's locked now, so it'll... We were trying to figure out how to blow up, does it blow up or whatever. And sometimes, time. sometimes he'll just pop up like he did with Janir, and other times he'll pop up and blow up. So, yeah. um, so it can be a little confusing on it. You know what, let's give it a four on that. Okay, we'll give it a four. We'll give it a four. So, so um, no, we really liked uh, Blowfish Blow Up, and I'm going to enjoy my Cabernet Sauvignon as we play a few more rounds. I'm Justin. I'm Janir. And this is Childish. Childish.